really like the sound of this target. So let's dig this one up, see what it is. Definitely doesn't sound like mineralization or a hot rock to me. Get this big boulder out of the way. Let's see what that does. It's right around in here. Okay, that looks good. Let's see if we moved it. Alright, still there. I'm gonna make my hole a little bit wider because with the 13 inch double D coil on really all the double D coils with the Axiom, they uh, are more sensitive towards the middle of the coil, which is, I guess, kind of a downside to the double D coils because you're not getting that edge sensitivity. And the edge sensitivity is nice because it helps you pinpoint the target a lot easier. And it also makes it a little easier to uh, get the target out of the scoop once you finally get it out of the ground. Okay, so this is a deep target. And the iron check isn't saying it's iron but it could as we get closer to the actual target. Normally you need to have a really super strong tone from the target for the iron check to really give you a good, good idea of what, what the target actually is. But we're getting pretty deep, which is possibly a good sign. Okay, we moved it. And the iron check is not saying that it's iron. Just trying to pinpoint it now. Okay, so whatever it is, it's right around in here. So let's see if we can figure out what this target is. Oh, I saw yellow. I saw yellow. Oh yeah, that's a good one. That is a real nice one. Check this out. Oh man. Wow, look at that. That's a good sized piece of gold right there. Let's clean that off and we'll take a closer look. Take a look at that. That's a nice chunky one right there. That might be pushing three quarters of a gram. I mean, wow, that's that's got some weight to it for sure. Yeah, all right, that's what I'm talking about right there. <laughs> yeah.